Hello, welcome back to another episode of A to Z of Python. Today we're going to be talking about module names. And in particular, there's one line of code that you probably have seen, and it looks a little bit cryptic, but it's going to be if name equals main and double equals, there we go. And that will come up from time to time in a lot of the different uh, scripts that you're looking at. And if you've never used it, you have no idea what it does. Today, we're going to talk about that. We're going to learn uh, when we should use it and what exactly it does. So let's create a few functions in our script here. And what we're going to do is we're going to do a print evens. And that's going to say printing all even numbers up to 100. And then we're just going to do a simple uh, for loop here that says for i in range 101, if i mod 2 is equal to 0. That's the standard procedure to get even numbers. If it's mod 2, it equals 0. It's an even number. And print that out. And then we're going to define a print odds, which is basically the same thing, but in printing odd numbers. So we're going to say printing all odd numbers up to 100. And we're going to do for i in range 101. If i mod 2 is not equal to 0, print i. So if we were, if we were to run this, let's just do uh, print evens and execute this. You see that it does exactly what we told it to do. It prints this out and then it gets all the even numbers. So uh, same thing here if we do changes to print odds. Run it again. We get the odd numbers. Okay. So our two functions are working just like we would expect. Now, let's say you wanted to execute this script from uh, like the console. You wanted to just do Python M and have it run. Well, you could do that. And we could go to like the command prompt and go to where our projects are and just do Python M. And it doesn't do anything, right? Because these functions aren't called anywhere in there. They're just defined. But if we were to do, uh, again, print odds or print evens and save that and run it, it does execute, right? So there's times where you'd want to call the standalone script and you'd want it to go ahead and do something. So let's make it do something. So let's do uh, choice equals input odds evens and then we'll do if choice equals odds and we'll call the function print odds and then we'll do else if choice equals evens, print evens. And now if we were to run this, we get to choose, we can type in evens, and there you go. So we have a problem here. Let's say we have another, uh, another file. So let's exit out here and we have something called M2 and we import m in here, what's going to happen if we run this? Okay, so you see that it starts executing the code in m. So when we, it, by importing a module into another Python uh, script, you're actually executing all the code that's contained within this. So Python runs all this uh, in, in the import sequence. 
And this can cause a bit of a problem because let's say I wanted to use print evens or print odds in my second script here, but I didn't want it to uh, run this part. Okay, I wanted to just create my own code where I do something with odds or evens. Well, that's a bit of a problem because it executes this automatically. But let's say that if I wanted to run M by itself, I would want to execute this. Well, that's where the names come in. So we can do, let's say if name equals main, tab this over. Now, if I run this, it does what we think it's gonna do, right? So we can put in evens and it works. But if we run this one, it doesn't do anything at all, okay? So this means that this will only run if this script is executed directly. If it is imported, okay, it will pass over this. And the reason that happens is that the name uh, variable of the script itself is assigned when it's run. And when you, when you run it, if you run it internally, it gets the name main. If you run it from by importing, it takes the name of the actual script itself. So instead of being name equals main, it will, in this particular scenario, it will be name equals m.py. And because the name is not main, when we import it here, this code is not executed at all. And so the reason that you would want to do that is, let's say we want to make this a standalone script, but we also want to make it to where people can import it and use the functions independently. That's when you would do that. So if I call uh, m, I can do evens, and it works. If I call m2, again, it does nothing because this is not executed. Once it's imported, it doesn't work at all. And that's pretty cool. So uh, that's really all there is to it. You can demonstrate this by actually printing the name here and printing the name here and seeing that it changes. But there's a bunch of video examples showing that. I don't really want to go into that, but I did want to show you that if you see this, if name equals main, what it's saying is whatever code is contained underneath that will only execute if the script is ran directly. It will not execute if it is imported into another script. And that's it. So hopefully that clears that up for you. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll be able to clarify anything that you need. Otherwise, thanks for checking it out.